Good morning guys, welcome to another vlog. Welcome to Vlogmas. I'm opening up the blinds. I just did a little Megan Roop Sculpt Society workout and I'm gonna go on a walk. I'm getting back into a workout routine-ish or just like moving my body more because I just been feeling so sluggish. Anyways, if you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. I will be vlogging every day this month. I'm not gonna be posting every single day because honestly, I feel like the videos just get worse as time goes on. And that's just so many videos for you guys to watch. So I'm going to be combining some. So like essentially expect a week in my life and a weekend of my life every week. There's probably going to be a few other videos thrown in there. And then I'm sure I'll do like one-off days and stuff like that. But subscribe. Welcome to Vlogmas. It's a different thing. If you guys are not aware of what Vlogmas is, basically you vlog every day in December up to Christmas, which I'm still doing. I'm just not uploading every single day. So we are here. I got back from New York last night. I immediately unpacked. I'm like the serial killer who like immediately unpacks my stuff. I have so much PR. My house just feels very cluttered. So I'm going to take the dogs on a walk, listen to a podcast. And there's a new Redheads episode. Didn't even read the book, but you know, just got to listen. And then I need to come home figure out what I'm cooking for the weekend and then go to Sprouts. My favorite place ever. I'm really craving my bacon sauerkraut breakfast that I've been making, but I don't have any bacon, so... All right guys, quick break to talk about today's sponsor, which is Hilma. I thought this would be a great thing to talk about, honestly, in the holiday season at all times, but especially in traveling. Like I find in traveling in the holiday season, I am eating a lot of different foods that I normally wouldn't. I'm feeling a little bit more bloated, slower, things like that. So Hilma is all natural and they have clinically proven ingredients. They're made with plants and minerals and have a clean label. But they're also developed with doctors and backed by clinical research. This stuff has really worked for me. I am really into it. So first we have the gas and bloat relief, which I'll probably talk about the most today. But we also have two other things. So this is the upset stomach relief and then this is the stomach reset. Hero ingredient in the gas and bloat relief is actually peppermint leaf, so it smells really good, but it's an aromatic herb that supports the digestive system. It is rich in soothing oils that calm the digestive tract and in clinical studies has shown to reduce bloating. I'm also impatient and what I love the most about this is that it works in the moment that I used it. I'm on the go all the time and I travel all the time. This has actually quickly become a travel essential. It's also not the biggest bottle in the world so it's great for just throwing in either my carry-on or my purse when I'm going out. You never know when I'm in New York. I'm gone all day and I have one bag. So I love this stuff. It has helped me so much again instantly so if you're having any bloating or like stomach discomfort i would really really recommend this product so you guys can use the code kenzie 20 for 20 percent off if you're getting anything honestly the first thing i recommend is the gas and bloat relief but yeah check out their website use kenzie 20 for 20 percent off thank you to hilma for sponsoring today's video you guys need this okay back from my walk we're quickly going to go through a pr package haul okay well this is a pr but i bought two kindles to do a giveaway sale i'll link it below too they were on sale for like 50 dollars. best purchase i've ever made the craziest thing happened to me i got pr from harry styles brand pleasing i i had no idea this was coming oh look at the angel they want their toys to be anywhere other than their toy basket guys i'm just thinking about it like i need to completely redo my living room it's just honestly it's cozy but it's there's too much stuff here it's really crazy it's just because this space is like two feet too small for everything else that i would want and then i you know you get a rug and the dogs make the rug messy i don't know honestly i've just kind of like given up i do have my love sack which honestly will probably go into the garage eventually but i just wanted it for now fitz loves it polishes which are really cute this is a serum for all skin types oh wow oh this is a refreshing eye gel and matte lip oil i'm actually very interested in this i think these are stickers this pleasing crew honestly i might throw that on to go to the grocery store we'll next i of course have queen of vlogmas alicia marie's vlogmas merch this is so cute it's my favorite merch of hers yet super fun Love that. Okay, from Girlfriend Collective, I have this brown bodysuit, which I honestly like want to wear today. It's just the cutest thing ever. Love that. I also got this set. I have so many workouts ahead. Their stuff is so good. And I also have these red leggings. I like this because they're thicker, 
So they're like better for like winter and fall for me. Oh, this also came from Set Active. Cute. I need to try this on because it seems like it might not fit, but I'm going to a friend's, I'm going as a friend's date to like a black tie event and I got this from Windsor. I might need to get it taken in or order a new one. I need to try that on like legit today. We'll see, the event is a week from tomorrow. Okay, then I have this, Serena Kerrigan sent me her Let's Fucking Date merch. And then it also came with like the card game, all these candy things, coloring book, condom, I think, literally. <laughs> Kendra Scott jewelry, which I'll show eventually. And then I got these heels, so they didn't put something too intense from Revolve. But now I'm kind of into like more intense heels and just sucking it up. But I thought they were cute. I'll link them below. The heel isn't like too insane. So they're just obviously good to have and they seem really comfortable. I'm honestly like tired. I'm just not fully awake yet. I made my menu for the week along with links. I'm just gonna go. This is actually not for the week. It's for the weekend. And I always end up eating out. But this will probably be like the next five days. These are just my go-to breakfast. I'm gonna make a vegetable soup and then I'm gonna make a bolognese that typically feeds like three times at least. And then I wanna try this. I don't know if I'm gonna get it this time around just because I don't know. I'm getting a coffee here because it's much needed. But we have to talk about something. The wires, they're back. I posted yesterday at the airport, said it's time to stop pretending we like AirPods and I was kidding. I like my AirPods, but then they just slowly over time stop working. They're never loud enough, and I like they're clean. It's not even that. It's just I've gone through like probably three or four pairs, and those are pros too, and they still just are not loud enough, and they're annoying. So anyways, I got wired headphones, okay? Bringing them back. They're really trendy apparently I, from what I saw on Instagram. I'm so tired. Oh my god. All right, well, never mind. We have quite the grocery haul. Um, I picked up a few things, quite a few things. Um, I also found new stuff, like gonna try this new coffee creamer. When I come back into town, the first things I do are my laundry and work out. I've already done laundry last night. I worked out this morning and then grocery shop. And then I like to make a big like soup or something so I'll have meals ready so I don't just like get tired and DoorDash. So, Anyways, here's my grocery haul. I have this green juice. I got this celery juice from the last time and they were out, but I actually really liked this. This is the coffee that I like to get. Some of my favorite marinara sauces. I got this little immunity drink. I've been drinking a lot of like juices and stuff. Um, minced garlic, coconut yogurt, another creamer, nut pod. Just wanted to try both of them. Annie's, it's like a snack. Zucchini, blueberries, green beans, kombucha. Um, this is the coffee I'm actually gonna have right now. I'm so tired. Heavy whipping cream, pasta, tomatoes, more sauerkraut, um, beef and pork, ground beef and pork for bolognese, celery, carrots, salmon, broccoli, bacon, not broccoli, and then kale. My phone just fell. That's the one thing with these wires, guys. Anyways, this is the grocery haul. I'm gonna put it away and then honestly shower and then get to cooking. <laughs> I'm in a true home outfit. I needed to get like a little bit ready. This is the new set from Girlfriend. It's just like a bodysuit. It's my favorite color. It's really comfortable. This sweater is Revolve. I got it, I think last season. It's not on the website anymore. I can look and try to link a similar. And then my Ugg slippers, but it is noon. I'm gonna make lunch and then get going. I have so much work to do. Um, I'm gonna make lunch, get going with my day. I need to drink some coffee. I'm exhausted. <laughs> Full home, like your situation as America's Next Top Model, too, because they're living in the model apartment. Oh my gosh, yeah. you gotta be kidding! Yeah, the sweet haircut. I know I've said this, but I just cannot believe how exhausted I am today. I mean, I have truly been going non-stop. I flew to New York at like 4 a.m. on Saturday night and I had a whole Friday night. I mean, I just, and then Thanksgiving and whatever. But I'm pushing through, it is Thursday. I have a lot to do. Um, I'm actually gonna record it for Mood later today. Lauren and I were supposed to in New York and then we just 
laid on the hotel bed and talked for like five hours so we didn't do that I have therapy in 30 minutes which honestly I never want to cancel and I'm not going to but like I switched it to virtual because I just don't have time to even drive there I have so much editing so much like podcast outreach just things like that my eyes are watering so bad I also started reading a new book last night called local woman missing I read 50% of it honestly I'm really enjoying it I'm so close to my goal of 100 books this year guys I'm getting there I'm currently drinking this juice I honestly need a nap but like I slept 10 hours last night I was supposed to wake up at 7 and I wake up till like 8 30 I hate starting my day off like later than I thought I also feel like I'm just not good at vlogging anymore like I watch my vlogs I do things and then I'm like I just does anyone care about this like I feel like I'm just not good at it anyways I just keep looking at my living room Currently, it just feels like my house is so cluttered, and I don't know if it's because of a, like Christmas decor or what. I don't know. And like, I should have gotten. Honestly, I hate to say it because I love that fireplace, but I really should have gotten a bigger one that's like more traditional. I don't know. I'm like, am I gonna completely redo my living room furniture like again? That is so much. It's seriously so much. But I also love that fireplace, and maybe I'm just overthinking it. You know, like maybe I just like shouldn't do any of that, and it's fine. My soup is simmering, and I am procrastinating my vlogging, so I'm gonna go open my laptop and get some stuff done but i just need to do those few things travel life hack post travel life hack this is the biggest thing i immediately take my suitcase i didn't even take it upstairs i immediately went to the laundry room and i put a load of laundry in there before i even went upstairs before i even said hello to my dogs like i just immediately get that done then take the stuff upstairs that um, I need immediately. Um, I showered, I got in bed, I read, went to bed, woke up this morning, immediately worked out. I had to get some sort of movement because I know that will make me feel better. So I did Megan Roop this morning and then I went on a walk. And then I made my grocery list, went to the grocery store, and now I'm cooking meals because if not, I will just be so tired, I'll be lazy, I'll order DoorDash and like not eat the stuff that like makes me feel the best and now we're getting to work so those are like the things that i have to do i'm open we've got a christmas party tomorrow my weekend on my life vlog is going to be so good i'm very excited finally got some stuff done the soup seems to be done simmering this is like the best part of my life i'm not kidding being at home cooking not talking to anyone and then knowing i'm gonna read tonight also by the way guys Beverly housewife merch available i'm getting tagged in so many things if you haven't gotten yours yet we have a lot of orders I don't know if you guys have heard about the supply chain. It's also not Amazon Prime. So some people have gotten there, some haven't. There's just a lot of orders, which is a good problem to have. Let's not forget. But if you guys need anything, need some gifts for yourself, your friends, your family, white elephant, whatever it is, check it out. It's a very good thing to do. Wow, that's so satisfying to me. Okay. Well, that was a lot more creamer than I would normally do. I love hazelnut creamer, so I hope I love this. It's just so cozy. The nap there, fit stays in a love sack. This candle, by the way, I'll link it below. It smells amazing. I got it from Anthropology. I get so many compliments on my house smelling so good, and I swear it's this candle. I finished therapy. I'm putting my soup in this beautiful container. By the way, these hold so much. My mom got me one for Christmas last year. And then I just ordered another one because I just had so much stuff that's really bothering me on there. Um, anyways, easy vegetable soup. So good. Hello, everyone. Okay, so it is now 3 p.m. I just got off a call. I'm going to Target because I just cannot focus today. I need to pick up some pajamas for my friends. We have a Christmas party tomorrow. And I was like, honestly, I need to get out of the house. So I'm just going to go to Target, get our pajamas. I need to pick up a few things to the house as well. So honestly, it should is it what I should be spending my time doing? No, but I just cannot focus. So I'm off with my cords. We're going to Target. The Target pajama selection for Christmas is just, the selection is just like not what it once was, at least here. I'm very impressed. I actually got these from last year, but like, I'm trying to text friends to see like what they want me to pick them up. Oh my god. It's just like not as good as normal. These are dresses. I don't know. Okay, these are cute also. This would be a really good like gift for someone. How much are these? $25, three piece set, pajama set with a eye mask. I think that's actually really cute. So I'm gonna get these. I'm getting Lauren and Terrence right now. How do I have four bags from Target? Like I was barely even here. No idea. It's four, still putting everything off. I needed to self tan, so I just showered and I self tan. I'm back from Target, obviously. I used the Ashley Graham 
Sultana, it's the best one ever. Um, it is currently 4 p.m. I need to get the rest of my work stuff finished. I decided that I'm going out tonight, so I don't know when I'm leaving. But we are now on a time crunch and we have things to do. I'm gonna wear this robe while my tanner dries. Like, this was risky, but honestly, like, I didn't have an option. I had to do it today to prep for the weekend. I self-tan every Thursday night, so. <laughs> I have therapy in 30 minutes. Oh, this is literally the best thing that I make and I haven't made it in forever. It's made easy bolognese. Sorry about this, guys. I'm in pajamas so I wouldn't get my tanner on uh, my furniture, but it's currently 7. I just made myself dinner. I'm going to go to a friend's house and then we're actually going to go out tonight. Um, I know I just got back in town, but I really miss my friends. It's literally been a week. I know it's like ridiculous. Honestly, you're only 24 once. You know what I mean? Like, come on. Another thing, too, I've been talking about a lot with my therapist is that, like, it's so interesting how we fixate on, like, one area of health. Like, we'll fixate on, you know, either, like, um, I guess, like, working out, diet, uh, skincare, I mean, like, whatever it is. But I just am, like, the first to neglect my social life, and I don't want to do that anymore. Not that it's a really big deal that I'm going out on Thursday night, but I'm just saying... Make sure you are looking at health from like an overall holistic perspective rather than just like, you know, I'm going to be super focused on eating healthy because I know that that makes me feel better and have more energy or whatever it is. So anyways, I'm going to go see my friends. I'm so excited for the month of December. I just feel like we have so much going on. Let me know what you guys want to see in the vlogs, what you guys think about the vlogs, what I can do better, what I should stop doing, what I should start doing, topics you want me to cover. I can start doing like more advice videos. I really like the video that Dom and I did where we answered like your best friend problems, things like that. What else in my life you guys want me to talk about more? I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'm up for it. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Lots of cooking, cleaning, getting my life back together, a little healthy reset. I say healthy because this is what's good for me. So You haven't even said hi to the vlog today. Hey, bud. I love you. I love you. So big. Oh, my God. Okay, well, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um... Be sure to check out Hilma and use code Kinsey20 for 20% off. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. There were multiple points, I'm not gonna lie to you, where I was just so happy I'm like I could cry. I did tear up at times. Give Usually me some on Mondays. <laughs> when you're just like so tired. Just so exhausted, so tired.